So over here you can see that this is my inbox and over here you can see that I have an unread mail right here and it has the number four besides it. That is because this is an email thread. So whenever someone sends out an email and you reply out to that email and they reply uh, you, uh, you back to that particular email itself, then what happens is that uh, Gmail keeps it as a thread so that the emails are linked with one another. So if I were to go around and click right here, you can see the latest mail on the bottom and you can see the timings over here as well. But you can also go around and access out the previous mails right here as you can see. So this is a thread. So if I were to go around right here, you can see that reply is an option and reply all is another option right here. So reply all is in case there are more than one receivers right here. So let me just go around and click on reply all so that I just don't send the sender, but everyone in the email uh, right here. So I can just go around over here and type in, let's say, for example, thank you for understanding right here, just like this. And then I can click on send. So once I do that, you can see that it stays on the same thread right here. So this is what makes it easy. If I were to click on it, since there are more number of emails, you can see that now I get this expansion button right here, which I can expand to view out more emails. I can go around and click anywhere right here to expand the email out. And what you can also do is you can click on the three dot button to see the trimmed content in case you don't have access to the previous mail, you see this option as well. So I can go around and click on it and see all of the previous contents over here as well. And that is how you can go around and then um, work around with email threads as well. Uh, if you're replying out to the same email time and again inside of Gmail. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.